If you look at global production, 100 million tons of pork is produced, of which 53, 56 million tons are produced in China alone, and that is half the world production. But they use an awful lot of antibiotics in the feed to make these animals grow faster. They are basically growth promoters because they kill all the bad bacteria. But with that, you also create resistance of bacteria, which cause problems for humans. There's other chemicals used to just stimulate. The latest that came out was that they actually give sleeping tablets to pigs. So they only get up to eat and drink, the rest of the day they sleep. And of course then they, they get as fat as you want. Uh, but it's not a normal way to rear an animal. Now with the seaweed, we managed to change or replace all these chemicals or antibiotics. And we have demonstrated that in commercial farms in Canada. Today we have arrived in, in beautiful Claggan Bay. As you can see all around you, this is Claggan Bay. And why Claggan? Because we have a seaweed farm here. When we pull the seaweeds from the lines, and this is only one plant, but you have to imagine that we have bucket loads and bucket loads full. We take it off the lines, it goes back to Milltown, where we have the different drying options, either with this kind of weather we dry it outside, or we dry it inside in our dedicated rooms. Once they're dried, we throw it through the hammer mill, then it is processed into a powder, and we can decide if it's coarse powder or fine powder or dust or coarse flakes. And depending on the client, what they want, it is shipped out. Ocean Harvest produces one feed ingredient of, or formulation specifically for swine, and that is to tackle specific problems in that industry. Now, with the seaweed, we manage to change or replace all these chemicals or antibiotics, and that is how ocean feed works. Pigs are healthier, they are more happy, and it all goes back to one thing, which is gut health. And the ingredients in ocean feed can have a negative effect on bad bacteria, but a positive effect on good bacteria. So the whole gut environment is improved. The animal takes more feed up out of the feed he's fed, and they grow faster and they're healthy. At the moment, food is produced in such a way where we use a lot of chemicals, a lot of synthetics, to either combat disease or combat bacteria or let the animals grow faster. And it's leading to a lot of problems. And now we have here this seaweed, which is abundant in a way, but you have to know what you're doing. And we can replace all these things. So we can go to a form of food production that is healthier for the consumer, is healthier for the animal, and it's a win-win situation.